Hi, let me present you how Game Analytics and Playmaker now work together very conveniently. I have here a project with just Playmaker and we're going to import Game Analytics and see how they work together. Let's go to the Asset Store, import Game Analytics. Game Analytics has now a built-in Playmaker detection and after it's importing assets, it will detect if Playmaker is present. If it is, it will prompt us with several options to actually make Playmaker and Game Analytics work together. Here we go. Do you want to enable Playmaker actions? Yes, it will create a set of custom actions so that within Playmaker you can work with Game Analytics and send events to the server. Let's say yes. And it also asks you if you want to install the Playmaker example, which is a breakout game, all done in Playmaker. And it's featuring uh, the use of the game, uh, game Analytics server. So yes, we want that. Let's wait for it to finish. Yes. If you choose not to install those custom actions or this example, because maybe you have a project where it's uh, in, you know, a real project where you don't want examples, you can always access those options in the Game Analytics menu, Playmaker, you can toggle scripts or import the examples. So scripts that are added are custom actions and they are found here within the Playmaker Actions browser. So we've got all those new custom actions to play with. Let's look at the game. Uh, game Analytics, Plugins, Playmaker, Examples, Breakout, Breakout game. Here we are with a simple game with a handful of um, FSM to run it. So let's look at it. That's a finite state machine within Playmaker. And this is, for example, the game over finite state machine, which when the game is over, sends a game analytics design event to the server and the event will be game over. There is other thing state machine like the add score and various management of the score where it sends an event to the game analytics uh, informing uh, about the particular score. If you want to learn more about those custom actions you can click here on this little blue book and it will take you online to the documentation of that specific custom action. And from there, it links to the Game Analytics own documentation where you can learn more about, for example, specifically the design event structure and how to really make the most out of those events. If you want to learn about how the finished state machine was designed, you can go let's come back to, the, to this inspector here and click on those little blue books here and they will take you to a documentation explaining what this particular thin state machine does. Here, for example, what I told you about the ad score, and there is an FSM description, tells you how it works with game analytics and what actions were used. If you need help and support for this, don't hesitate to go on, let's show, the Playmaker forum or the Game Analytics forum. We will be happy to help. Thank you very much. Bye.